Ladies and gentlemen, once again, a round of applause for all our guests from Stanford Bridge and also our invited guests this afternoon. Learn part, learn part. <laughs> Very good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, especially the members of the media, and a very, very warm welcome to our friends all the way from Chelsea FC. Selamat datang to Malaysia. Allow me to introduce our panelists for this press conference this afternoon. The manager of Chelsea Football Club, Mr. Andre Villas Boas. Head of Communications and Public Affairs, Mr. Steve Atkins. And the two players that we have for you in our press conference this afternoon is Mr. Frank Lampard and Branislav Ivanovic. We also like to say a warm welcome to Mr. Julian Kam, CEO of Pro Events. Mr. Sandra Kwan, Managing Director of Pro Events. Dr. Azurin Ahmad, General Secretary of the Football Association of Malaysia. And Mr. Ong Kim Sui, Head Coach of Arima Muda Malaysia. for the Chelsea FC Asia Tour 2011 Malaysia. Our official time call, Salcom. A warm welcome to the Chief Executive Officer, Dato Sri Shazali Ramli. <laughs> From the official Air Charter, Malaysia Airlines, Executive Vice President, Commercial Strategy, Malaysia Airlines, Dr. Dr. Amin Khan. <laughs> From our official automobile sponsor, NASA World. Please welcome Dr. Ubira Azam Khan. And also a very avid Chelsea fan. And uh, representing our gracious host, the One World Hotel, on behalf of Dr. Teo Chiang Hong, owner of the One World Hotel, please welcome Ho Hoi Sam, general manager of One World Hotel. And not forgetting our members of the media who have made it here from uh, near and far to be with us for the Chelsea FC Asia to uh, Malaysia. And not forgetting all the Chelsea fans in attendance as well. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, it gives me great pleasure to invite Mr. Julian Kamp, CEO of Pro Events, to say a few words before we begin with the press conference. A uh, warm welcome to everyone attending the press conference today, and a warm welcome to Chelsea Football Club Back to Asia, Back to Asia, and to kick off the tour in Malaysia. Uh, all the best uh, for your for your new season, and uh, we wish. Uh, our own team, our Malaysian team, to have a good match against Chelsea Football Club on Thursday. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Mr. Director. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we open the floor to the uh, question and answer session. Once again, to the members of the media, can you use the three microphones set up at each aisle for you to forward your questions to our panelists this afternoon? If you have the first question, please. before you came to the country that you don't intend to do too many things different to the previous management. But can you tell us about how you intend to shape the team in terms of strategy, in terms of tactics, uh, formations? Last season, Fernando Torres didn't have the best season. Maybe you can share with us how you're going to try to score more goals. But more interestingly, in terms of the formation that you intend to play. No, but I think uh, I'll start on your, uh, on your final Question: I'm not a striker, so uh, I'm just uh, trying to for my strikers to build on their confidence. And this comes with the qualities that they have, and not, that it's just not from information that I give them. Uh, I think exactly the opposite. It's, it's the players that offer me uh, the solutions, and, and, uh, and we find uh, a balance in between of ideas to, to put uh, to put us into into the road to success, which is what we want. So I think that's much more important than uh, than. Uh, then uh, again, then myself was showing uh, which kind of ideas that uh, I'm trying to implement. I mean, uh, uh, there's plenty of talent in this squad, as I told you before, in uh, the press conferences, and 
I want to believe that uh, that the players can still find uh, new things in them to, to exploit, and, uh, and I want to fully potentiate uh, their talent. So uh, then again, it's it's always uh, uh, them that offer to me rather than, than myself offering offering to them. Uh, regarding our, our preparation, our preparation will continue in, in Asia. Uh, we are very glad that we are we are here sharing these experiences with you because it was important for us to touch on on the Asian market and the amount of fans that we have in, in Asia. Uh, we will continue with our philosophy in the first uh, in the first game of, uh, of 45 minutes. Uh, to, uh, both, both two teams in 40 minutes, 45 minutes, and uh, well, we're trying we're trying gradually to build on a, on a, on a new way of uh, new way of playing and uh, a getting together of ideas, and hopefully by by 7th of August when we initiate the, the week running into the Stoke game, we'll be able to to be already. Uh, Almost the experience that we need to, to bring us to, to success against so. them. Are you more inclined to 4 4 2 or 4 3 3 at the moment? Um, I really don't want to focus a lot on formations because, um, I mean, we are. Uh, this, this, this kind of players offer this kind of flexibility, to, for the flexibility for you to play in, in various different ways. So, um, I mean, it's, it's, it's not just a question of uh, a formation is going to give you more than, than another one. I think. Uh, uh, with what they have, we'll try to find a, find a better way to play so that they can potentiate their own talent as individual and as, as, a, as a collective group. We have a question from back. Andreas uh, Doug from the ESPN Star Sports. Is this tour for you about building relationships with your new players? You're going to spend a lot of time together. <coughs> well, it's, 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 uh, it's 15 days and it's going to be uh, a frenetic 15 days, but uh, we're part of a uh, of, uh, of the, of the tour, and we are happy to, to, to take it like that. I mean, it's, it's nothing new that uh, the, the top uh, European teams move abroad. They uh, not only to show themselves to, to the fans based uh, abroad, but also to, uh, to get together in, in, in that sense. So, I mean, it's going to be an intense 15 days. Um, I mean, this is, this is always important. You can, you can do it in Asia, or you can do it in Europe, or in, in, in America, or other countries. But uh, it's, al it's always important for us to, to touch on, on the people that love us and are far, far away from us. Yeah. Next question, please. Yeah. Right on the back. Hi, Ian Bolton from Sky Sports News. Nice to see you here. Uh, can I first check, the, the list we have is 26 players. Is everybody fit? Are there any players that are Slight yeah, we are, we are we nothing uh, out of the ordinary apart from uh, obviously uh, Michael, which, uh, which of course we do travel with the team and you know what this problem is. Uh, and it's a big uh, big blow for us, uh, not only as a player but as a, as a person and only represent as a person. Uh, regarding uh, the other injuries, it's, it's just uh, minor, normal pre season injuries and, 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 and pre season discomforts here and there. Due to the amount of training that these players have been putting and the intensity that they put in training sessions, so nothing out of the ordinary with uh, with Alex and and and, and Peter Shek, and uh, you'll readily see them see them back uh, in this process. And can you tell me where we are, where things stand with uh, Thibaut Courtois from Genk? Are you close <coughs> to to signing him? Well, the medicals are being done at this moment, so only after the medicals are not done, uh, personal terms we will come to that. If he does go through the medical and agree in personal terms, will he join you actually in this talk? Um, most likely not. Um, Kenny Dalglish and Sarah Spencer, they've been buying British a lot this season. Will you be doing the same? I've been what, They've been buying British a lot. A lot of British players. Will you be doing the same in the future? No, uh, I mean, uh, the market has is plenty of us of, uh, of offer, and we have to decide according to what our needs are. And you, uh, we can't forget that we are uh, 15 days together, and these 15 days is always a continuous evaluation for us. I mean, we're not putting players in the test because uh, they are top quality players, but we need to get the most information as, as possible. And uh, as I told uh, yesterday in, in, 